Oh, well. Two guys to merc. Three items to pick up. And, ah, uh, fuck it, we'll run. We'll do it. We'll do the running of the dogs. We'll, we'll get the, what, the one item? Something like that. And we'll head on home, talk to Yuria, talk to Grey Rat, buy some stuff. Miss our weapon art, because I'm amazing. Yeah, so there's something about the Flamberge, again, for people who don't know this game. Where people reckon they bugged... Well, the theory is... The weapon art does a lot more damage than most greatswords will do with the stance weapon art. As if it was supposed to have the um, stomp weapon art, which is what the bastard sword has. So, yeah, the theory is they changed the weapon art but never fixed the damage modifier. Which is why this thing does so much fucking damage. I, I'm not complaining, though. It's rad. So, yeah, we got some stuff. Farron Cole, Tome, Braille, Paladin's Ashes. We can also buy the Exile Armor, so, you know, we'll do that eventually. What are we at? 36, was it? Yeah. We're probably not going to bleed him out, but... Dig it deeper, just to throw it away. Well, I've killed you for the hundredth time. Bring X in every line. I'm not going any further with the Lincoln Park. Now I remember in the Cinders mod, on some div on some of the uh, some instances of the challenge mode, they put a big old uh, cathedral monster here, a big old uh, Sullivan beast. Oh well, not a beast. What do you call it? The fucking accursed one. Whatever the fuck it is. Evilac, you know, the spider. That thing. Pretty cool. I remember they used to have them patrolling around the, um... Around the central area of the cathedral, near the giants. That was kind of scary, to be honest. Because those guys like hitting you through walls. And they will curse the hell out of you. Yes, they can be, actually. Thank you, Nameless King. But we killed him. He seems to know the plunging attack's coming, so I never bother nowadays. And yeah, yep, nailed it. Thank you, comrade. Because I'm being vain. Yeah, fair enough. Nope. Nope. I framed it too. Alright, that's the one item we gotta get. I'll see if we can... There's one coming, I think. Yep, bolt. I'll see if we can kill them, but I doubt it without murdering the dogs. Alright, here we go, guys. Ready to learn how to instant transmission? Run. Yep. Look, I would have left all the dogs, but I didn't want to have to go back for that one soul. Bitch. An actual bitch, because you know it's a dog, you know. It's, it's a pun. Got you. Hope I don't get invaded now, because I kind of want to call it a night. Two swords up ahead. Both pretty great. One is ultra great. One is just a great. And this is a decent hiding spot, but if you get found, you are trapped. So have fun with that. You could always hide nail with the door shields. That'd be really dumb though. Ah, oh, someone at the altar, huh? Notch whip. Wish it was better. Alas, it is not. Who is this? Oh, merciful goddess. My please bear witness to our resolve. Fire for Ariandel. Fire for Ariandel, and the ash to kindle flame. <gasps> yeah, sorry, try to try to light the bonfire halfway through. That's clever of me. We can't break the candelabra. How disappointing. Alright, so we're here at the Cleansing Chapel. We've got an Esther Shard, 
I'm not getting the swords, but let's talk to this guy. Wait. You've... You've the same scent as that woman. Then you must be an action one. You must be. Oh. <laughs> you don't know how long I've searched. Oh. 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 Don't mind me. Didn't mean to fall apart. <laughs> Now, Fashion One, I have a kindness to ask of you. My lady lives in the cold land of Ariandel. I need you to show her flame. A proper flame that will burn the rot away. If you truly are Ash, then it must be fire that you see. Ah, thank you. They of Ash never fail. Just a moment, then. The painting of Ariandale. Well, rotted scrap of it, that is. Go on. Take it. Ashes were too. <laughs> it's been a while since I actually watched that. Hmm. Anyway, that's Gale. He'll show up much later. He's a pretty cool fight when that uh that when that happens, but uh, he's meant to be Artorius number two, but uh, mm. yeah, hi. I'm just, I, look, I just want, I just want the moths. All right, I'll have a quick chat. Ah, huh? huh? uh, have you just arrived? How very unusual! Just how long has it been? Rejoice, my new friend, for this is a true haven of the forlorn. The cold and gentle painted world of Ariandel. Quick, go along. Find one for yourself. A sweetly rotting bed to lie upon. Yeah, so this is where the Corvians come from. That wasn't blatantly obvious. What are bones? Quite a few pelvic bones. And whatever that. It's meant to be. We got the skull. The hell if I know where it came from. This truly is the DLC. No reference to Seif, because well, you know, he's not here. He has got no he's got no legs, but it doesn't really bear mentioning outside of that. Yeah, like here's the thing. Gale's really cool. Spoilers, he's the final boss of the di of the final part of the DLC, and I do like him, but I don't really care about him to be honest. Because I get I get the idea that oh he's like you, an ashen one who survived throughout the ages. Well, actually, he's proper undead, but I'll, I'll rant about him in a sec. Oh my. This coal is from the Undead Legion, used to forge the weapons of Farron's Abyss Watchers. A fine prize. I'm honored to be endued with it. Now I'll be equipped to infuse special gems. Praise the gods, eh? Time to put this brawn to use. <laughs> Alright, quick number crunching. 
Ah, fuck it, the raw gem for now. It's better than nothing. Yeah, Gale's cool, but I don't necessarily feel much because he shows up there as the entrance to the DLC, um, the first part, shows up as a summon for the end boss of said DLC, shows up a few times in the Ring City as a summon, guiding you, and then he's just kind of there at the end. I understand he's meant to be a survivor from possibly before Dark Souls 1, but I don't know. It's, it's not that he's a bad character. I personally just don't feel anything. Kind of shitty, to be honest, in my... <laughs> I'm, I'm being shitty, but... Yeah, I don't know. Yep, so Great Swamp Pyromancy Tome. Spells of the Great Swamp are passed down from master to pupil. Without a master, there is no pupil. But without a pupil, there is also no master. And a sacred railed tome of Karim, filled with advanced miracles. Give to a storyteller to learn advanced Karim miracles. They're only slightly better. In the way of the white, in the way of white, there is a tradition of placing great faith in the words of the blind, and braille tomes are not unusual. Yeah, so advanced py pyromancies, I figured I'd just read that part. Umbral Ash of a worn out paladin who sought the Cathedral of the Deep. With this, the Shrine Handmaiden will prepare new items. This paladin paid quite a price for his headstrong justice. And that's what we got from y'all. Alright, let's give this stuff. Talk to Grey uh, talk to yeah, Grey Rat, buy some shit. Ah, and then we'll be done. Yes, here we are. It's been long indeed. With this I can teach you more sophisticated pyromancies. Splendid. I can boast I'm your tutor a little longer. <laughs> So Fire Orb, which is rad, I'll probably grab that eventually. Bursting Fireball, which is pretty cool. It's not incredibly useful, but you know, it's got its purposes. Uh, purposes. Fire Surge we could get earlier. Most efficient Pyromancy and good for finishing off people. Great Combustion, just bang. Fucking mini nuke. Not quite Black Flame, but still. Poison Mist, awesome if you want to cheese the game as a low level or a stealth build. Flash Sweat, we could have already got that. That's for surviving in fire. Handy for one location in particular. And Profuse Sweat, upping Poison, Curse, Frost, um, Bleed Resistance. Right, well, Do not think we can always upgrade our Pyro Flame, but I'm, I haven't even used the Fireball yeah, outside of hitting the uh, Boreal Knight, the Outrider. Oh, champion. Oh, you've brought me a Braille Divine Tome. Now I can tell new tales of miracles. Tales of the greater miracles can be quite the epics. What fun we will have. <laughs> yeah, Force. Pretty cool. Homeward. Go home. Go to a bonfire with no um, bone required. Tears of Denial. Very meta. That's why people use ar armor reforms. Caressing Tears. Heals, um, status ailments, replenishment, health over time, medium heal and heal will pretty self-explanatory. No, yeah, heart, nothing else. Have a Compared to a lot of the miracle teachers, I like Arena. Um, what's his name? Saint Urbane in Demon Souls. Fairly interesting, but he's, he's, he's a dick. Just putting that out there. Oh, I can upgrade the whip. Sick, we'll do that. Um, Rhea's pretty alright. She has some stuff going on with Petrus. But even then, not very in-depth, to be honest. Yeah, so the Sharp Gem, I think, is not... Why am I doing this to myself? I shouldn't be needing to perform the math right now. No, no, Sharp Gem should be better, but we won't bother right away. Yeah. Raw gems actually what we want for the meantime, but fuck it. I'm going to bed, so who cares at this point? Grey Rat's got some cool shit. Oh, hello. You've come at a good time. It took some prowling, but I finally made a score. Go on, have a gander. All right, so yeah, healing. I never use these, even though I should. Bandit knife, we'll grab that for later. He, we, he already had that. 
Busted Sword grabbing for later. Zweihander, really cool, we'll use that at some point perhaps. No guarantees, but maybe. Pontiff Knight Curve Sword, fucking try hard weapon. Estoc, also a try hard weapon. Grab the mace, a war pick. Potentially a try hard weapon, but pretty fun. Spears, meh. Glaive, I like a lot. But we got its big brother, the Wing Knight Halberd, so. Short bow, we're gonna get the composite bow relatively soon, so that's much better. We'll buy a light crossbow, it's unlikely I'm gonna get one. We've got the various shields, the assassin armor, which is really cool, I like it a lot. Not very good for a poise, but whatever. Goodbye. And stay safe. Oh, this place is a ball. What good is thievery if you've nowhere to go? <laughs> Right. What have you got to say? Best girl. Just saying it again. Oh yeah, we'll talk to you in a sec. Okay. While I'm at it. Pyrogarb. Wrap, trousers, and crown. Do Thank you. Alright, let's have a chat. Oh, you're back then. Again. I'm Orbeck of Minheim. Here to teach you sorceries. Let us begin with the basics. The ideal sorcerer bears the twin faces of the dragon. It... Oh, you could at least act as if you're paying attention. It is folly to claim lives recklessly, friend. Do not be tempted. No matter the victim's stature, every killing has a consequence. Even as I bloodied my hands, I never realized this simple truth. was the very definition of a fool. I don't mean to seem overbearing, but have you forgotten? In exchange for my sorceries, you are to bring me knowledge in the form of scrolls detailing the secrets of sorcery. I hope you're not one to break a promise. I don't mean in the I hope. All right, we're not really going to be using anything from here ever. Spook, yeah. We'll grab Far Fire and Flash Sword because once we get Pestilent Mercury, sorry, Pestilent Mist now, uh, we can get this, the oh, Slumbering yeah. Dragon Crest Ring, which is for stealth. And I don't exactly have a lot of rings to use that are worthwhile. Yeah, the Chloramphy Ring's kind of debatable at this point, well, but I haven't really got a reason to indulge. Actually, hold on. One more person to sp ah, oh, two more people. You haven't given up yet. Then you're a brasher lad than I thought. You can make better use of this. I don't need it. Not now I've flown the coop. <laughs> the undead legion of Farron is a caravan of undead, sworn by wolf's blood to contain the abyss. The legion will bury a kingdom at the first sign of exposure. Joyous bunch, really. Gaining admission to the legion is a matter of some ceremony. Inside their keep, snuffing out the flames of three altars opens the door to the wolf blood. Even a cursed undead want to believe they're special, it seems. I pity the sorry souls. <laughs> Gaining admission to the evil. Yeah, if it wasn't apparent, our friend here was part of them. Part of their little gang, and then chickened out for various reasons. Some quite reasonable. Hello there. Oh, prithee. Art thou good yours, master? I am Yuria of Londor, a close friend of his. Thanks to thee, your soul is redeemed. Allow me to express my gratitude in his stead. Another matter. That a lord art thou not? Bearer of the dark sigil 
and our Lord of Hollows. For the time thou remainst our Lord, we of Londor shall serve thee. And I, of course, am also thine. Oh, good Hollow. I'm afraid I must say. Orbeka Vinheim is a cause of much consternation. He proclaimeth himself Lord of Hollows. If left alone, he may one day imperil thy rule. Fall to this matter yearly, else we are unraveled. Decisiveness is the mark of a true monarch. Orbeck of Vinheim, if left for Till we meet again. May the dark sigil guide thee. Yeah, so in case it wasn't apparent, yeah, we're being used big time. So let's see. Purging stone, good for ho for when you want to look human again. We'll grab that later on when Carla shows up. You can buy sorceries off her and Yol, but you might as well give him a fallback for his quest. Dark Hand, the ultimate weapon in beating the game at a low soul level. Look human and, you know, don't be gl a glowing color when you're an invader or summon. And always look like a white phantom if you're a summon or an invader. Nothing we really want there. I'm going to have to piss her off later on. Probably in the next part or so. So we can get her friend, the Pale Shade, to try to murk me. Right, so that's handled. Yeah, um, it's kind of weird people don't mention the obvious that she's, you know, meant to be Mephistopheles. Uh -huh. Kind of odd. Gracious, I yeah, okay, we got some stuff. Like, Morningstar, the Canvas Talisman, etc, etc. For Crescent Axe, which was neutered compared to 1 and 2, it's kind of crappy in this game. I try to like it, but it's not very good. Um, hmm. Right. We do have this. The Exile Armor and the Big Sage's Hat. The Sage's Big Hat. Oh yeah, and this is important too. Lloyd Shield Ring. Full health, you get absorption. Pretty rad. I'm sorry I've gone to like full on explaining mode, but fuck it. <laughs> Just in case people don't know. Alright. One in Faithful later on. So we can get Kafa's Flame Mark. Also because I think... Over here. Oh. Mm, yes, he does have the chime. We'll just buy it. There we go. Goodbye. And we'll buy we'll buy heal aid as well, because why not? Probably won't use it, but Arena never sells it, so let's grab it. And then we'll grab three of these for the mimics. I don't really want any of this armor. We've got plenty of arrows. We're good. Cool. Radio. Oh, one thing. I'll deal with the bell tower proper next episode, but I'm gonna head up here and see if we got one of those seeds. And this can this kind of became like a pseudo filler episode by the end, didn't it? Patches shows up there later on. Ah, oh, damn it, almost did it. Right, cool. There's Ludloff. We'll have a chat to him later when we've actually got the fucking you know the thing to talk to him over. Right, so that's all that shit done. Um, yeah, I kind of intentionally didn't level there, bar the faith. That's just, that's for Kafa's Flame Arc, which we get after the Abyss Watches, and for, like, he healing spells. Plus, I do want two more levels, so I can eventually use, um, Boulder Heave. Once I kill Greatwood, for real. Because that's a fun pyromancy to have for the knockdown. Anyway, we're done. That's enough of this shit. I've recorded effectively three over three hours tonight, so... Boy, hope I don't lose my voice again. I got three days of teaching. This is gonna be great. All right, thanks for coming along. All that shit. Might do some farming in between, but I'm pretty happy with the weapons and stuff I've got. No tight night, but I got plenty of good stuff. Right here, generic YouTube. Goodbye, because you have to wave. I'll be using my thanks when I have it. But for the meantime, 